Hey, y'all. Welcome to Peyton Energetics. I'm Peyton, and I'm a Pleiadian channel and starseed coach. So in today's weekly energy report, I wanted to talk about something that a lot of us have been feeling, but we may not exactly know what it is that we're picking up on. So something that is going on in the energies right now is that we've moved into a major new phase of what the Pleiadians have been calling for the past three years, the separation of timelines. So this, of course, has been underway for a while. But according to the P's, recently we took a major new step into a new phase of the operation. So the timeline split has accelerated rapidly. So whereas for the past three years, we've been kind of in a waiting room, it has felt like we've been a little stalled for a while. The guides say that the timelines have now split sufficiently that we are really seeing the 3D world stripping away from us. Now, this, of course, is going to be a gradual process, but what is happening in the energies right now is we're being called to pull all of our arms and legs onto the same bus. So what we are seeing in the energies right now is a very strong pull to stay focused on our chosen timeline. So what the guides mean by this is we can't straddle both worlds anymore. And if y'all listen to the last monthly energy report, the Pleiadians were talking about something they see happening in the spiritual community where a lot of us are trying to keep one foot in both worlds. So we're doing our spiritual will work on the one hand, but we're still flirting quite a bit with 3D, right? We are still getting invested in those mainstream stories. We're still hanging out with people who are draining and depleting of our energy. We are still playing with narratives and storylines of fear and anger and judgment. So according to the guides, this is no longer supported by the energy. As the guides say, you gotta pick a side. So we can't straddle the fence anymore. And this is something, of course, that we have been working on for a while now. We don't master this instantly, but this is what we're sensing in the energies right now. So some of the ways that this might show up for you is you might feeling a real sense of kind of repulsion about the 3D world. You may find that you are completely disinterested in it, that you don't really want to have anything to do with it, that you're pulling away and cutting ties from people who have made the choice to continue to play with those descending timelines. So what is happening is these energies are kind of forcing us to finalize our decision, to stop flirting with things that are not on our timeline. Because as the P's were saying in the last monthly energy report, you can't be on two different trains right now. So all arms and legs have to be in the same train going in the same direction. So what you may be seeing in the energies right now is that you're being very pulled away from anything that is not on your timeline. And so for a lot of us, that is feeling a strong sense of disinterest in anything 3D, anyone who wants to talk about 3D topics, any platforms that are spewing fear messaging, messaging intended to put us in anger or disempowerment, you may feel a kind of a zero tolerance policy toward that. And the reason for that is, is that it is time to go all in on the path we have chosen. We can't play in the gray zone anymore. So that is the most important thing that we are experiencing in the energies right now is that strong pull to kind of solidify our path. So we can't play with both sides of the coin anymore. It is all or nothing. So what you may be noticing is the 3D world is getting more and more uncomfortable. It's almost intolerable to be outside in it, be around people who are very in that vibration, the descending vibration. It may just be something that you just can't stand anymore. Its vibration is so out of alignment with you that you want nothing to do with it. And that is what is happening in the energies right now. We are having to go all in in whatever direction we have chosen. And as always, we are never saying this from the perspective of ego. No one's path is better or worse than anyone else's. And we're just seeing the results of our choice. And some people have chosen things that are very different than what we have chosen. 
And that doesn't make us any better or worse than anyone else, but we can't have it both ways. So that is what is happening in the energies right now. If you have been sensing that, you're not making it up. It is a very strong undercurrent of what's going on right now. Now, some other ways that this may show itself to you, some other ways that it's manifesting for some people is it may feel like the 3D world is starting to speak a foreign language. It was so funny. I was on social media the other day and I was scrolling through reading some of the non spiritual things that I follow, which there's not a lot. And as I was reading some of the posts, I'm like, what are they even talking about? It was complete gibberish to me. It was like it made no sense. So you may be noticing this as you talk to people who are on very different paths than you, that that world is just feeling like it doesn't exist in your reality anymore. And that's exactly what's happening. So it's starting to become so foreign that we're just not even interacting with it anymore. So you may notice this in several different ways as you interact in the 3D world, that it's just getting farther and farther away from you. That it's not part of your reality anymore. And that is going to continue to accelerate. That's what these energies are doing. So I hope this has helped you understand the current energies a little more in case you were sensing this, but weren't quite sure what was going on. Let me know in the comments below, how are y'all doing in these energies? They're kind of strange. So drop that in the comments below. And while you're down there, don't forget, hit the subscribe button and the like button if you haven't done that yet. I'll see you next time. Bye.